Hey guys, it's Gregor and welcome back to Life is Strange. So last time we did episode 3, we went back in time, then we went back forward in time, and then we saw something very horrible. So let's continue, and let's see what happens. Okay, so Chloe in a wheelchair, that's... That's, uh, that's really, that's really something, I'm not gonna lie. So, I'm actually curious what's gonna happen. I really don't know, and it's kind of making me nervous. Because my choices, I feel like, aren't the best ones. I don't feel like my choices are the best choices I've made so far. But hey, I'm trying. I'm trying, and I'm screwing up. <laughs> oh, look, it's the crab. Hello, Mr. Crab. What are you doing with the beach, silly crab? Oh, look, he's, he's like, crab walking. <laughs> I love crabs. Well, I don't like them. Like, I like to eat them, but that's it. They're weird, weird animals. I don't know what I think about them. So yeah, we got the beach to whales. We had the eclipse. We had the storm. I feel like uh, we're just making it worse. It seems like it really uh, feels like that. Hey, there's a the dead whale. Hey, dead whale. How you doing? He's not doing well, he's dead. <laughs> oh. It's sad though, it's a sad whale. Three sad whales. Well, I guess they have to rename the bar. <laughs> oh man, oh man, I'm, I'm not funny today. <laughs> so what are we gonna do about this though? We can't just, you know, episode four, the dark room. This is interesting because Nathan was talking about the dark room, Rachel in the dark room, Rachel in the dark room. Maybe we can find out what that means. It's so sad to see Chloe like that. I liked her more with her blue hair and, you know, the ability to walk. It's so sad. I don't like that. I don't like sad. Sad makes me sad. Please be happy. More happy, please. Mm. But maybe we can find out what happened, though. I think she got in a car crash? It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. No. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. Of course. It's more than any of my other friends have done. No. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. No. <laughs> but I love writing on it like <laughs> an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. So sad. Probably easier to write than to visit me. No. I don't mean that in a Pitchy way. Yeah, you Not do. Totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much. Yeah. But the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. Mm -hmm. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can yeah. You stop. It doesn't change people. This is seriously the best view of the sunset. It's so sad what if though. The first called up. The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Those beached whales are so sad. Yeah. I kind of know how they feel. No. At least, I'm alive here with you. It is so sad. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. Yeah. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I understand, though. I can do that. Along with my parents. But what are those things near her my head? My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. No. Talk about the accident. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Bell. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap, and, and that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. That is so fucked, dude. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. Yeah. I I, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I really don't. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. No. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. Oh yeah, she's not friends with her. You mean Rachel Amber? When was the last time you talked to her? Uh, never. 
I just oh. read about her in the news. Yeah, because I didn't even know her oh. name. you did. This is that is so different so different than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. No. Oh. You think? Do you think so? I uh, haven't kept up with the details. She never met I Amber. I have more time on my hands than you. Plus, I'm a science nerd. Science. But none of this makes sense. No way. I know seem out of control, but as long as we're together, mm -hmm. I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. That is so Listen, cute. Chloe, I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. It was. You're my best friend. Mm -hmm. Max, thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should go back to my place? <laughs> okay. It is hella cold out here. Hella? I hate that word. Oh, because... that is so weird! <laughs> Chloe's so different. She's so different now. She's a science geek. She never met Rachel Amber, obviously. And she hates that word, hella. That is so weird. It's, it's really interesting, though. I really... I don't know what to say about this alternate timeline thingy. Ah, uh, what should we do? Like, should we go back and then kill the father again or something? It's so difficult because if he dies, she said. If he doesn't die, she said. She's always sad. There must be a way to to help and fix this. I think. At least I try to. But then again. What if the universe doesn't want you to fix it? What if the universe is just the universe and that's it? Thinking about that is pretty, pretty interesting. <laughs> Holy shit. Spell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. Mm -hmm. I know it's hard for them. It would be hard for I'm anyone. I'm you are here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Hey, that's what you always do. I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive when you don't even have to be. Aww. Trust me, I still get my rage on. <laughs> Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my Aww. bum. Yeah, that's so fucked. Me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. Yeah. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Mm. Uh, can you can you bring me some water? That is so sad. You're making me sad. <laughs> making me very very sad. Where's the water? Hello, Chloe. <laughs> she likes fluffy animals. That is now. so weird. Oh. The snow dough. I guess not everything changed. Okay, where's your water, though? Is that water? Instead of handing Chloe a bong, I'm feeding her water. Did I give her a choice? They're so, so weird. Chloe is still a punk at Okay. Heart, <laughs> but she can't stage dive anymore. Mm. That's so cool that Chloe has made friends online. Okay, so let's see. Uh, oh, is her name Miss Blue? Oh no, her name is Ign Ignatius. Okay, so what are you doing talking to you? Ah, no shit. I'm about to binge on Quantum Leap. Oh my god, love! <laughs> Scott, B Bacula rules. Oh, that is so sad. I I'm sad. I'm very sad. Here, have some water. I'm sad. Drink up, Buttercup. Have some sad water. Oh man. No wonder my throat is dry. <laughs> I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Why Dude, not? I am a pod in a cast. <laughs> Boring. Ouch. Jesus it Christ. Was just a thought. <laughs> that is pretty I, I sweet. To help. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. 
What do you remember? What do you remember about us as kids? We all have different memories. Yeah. I think about us as little pirates running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. Me too. But we're still pirates in our own way. <laughs> yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. <laughs> no way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with. That is so me. sad. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. Mm. Hey, you you're have me. me. I'm not leaving you, Chloe. Yeah. You didn't visit me a lot either. I know, but still. I mean, I loved your cards and photos, but I know I wasn't around much. No excuses. I'm. I was in a different dimension. I'm sorry. I'm trying to make things right. Oh. Wow. Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. I can fix this. They love you. They love you so much. I know. My mom and dad are so cute. They always pop in here and make sure everything's okay with me. Mm -hmm. I think Joyce and William are incredible. They are. Max. The accident has been so hard on them. It's hard on everyone, dude. Our insurance sucks and the medical bills are fucking insane. Jesus. Can they pay? Can they pay all the bills? <sighs> no way. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a Jesus. year. Jesus! You're priceless. <laughs> uh, that is so much! No pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. Jesus Christ. You. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. The so, yeah, U.S. so weird. A human entertainment system. Aww. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> What do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. Aww. I always cry at the end. Okay. Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. Aww. You would look incredible. With yes, me. she would because well, she does. The show on the road. This is so. Oh. Me like you always do when we watch movies. I remember Max. I swear I won't fall asleep. Mm. Not when you're here. Not yet. That is so. So cute and adorable. That must be her mighty morphine machine. Jesus Christ. No more bonks for her. Yeah, no more bonks indeed. She has to use that ventilator just to breathe. Fucking nuts. Wow, sir. Chloe was a straight wow. A student. Wow. That is actually pretty she goddamn go good. Any college. Gutless bastard. I'm okay. so glad Chloe stole your bullshit fund. Okay, so uh, let's Even see. It wasn't another reality. Shut up. Okay, uh, dear Mr. and Mrs. Price, as principal, I am in sympathy uh, with your numerous requests for Chloe's special needs in regards uh, to her wheelchair and class accessibility, etc. Blackwell prides itself on making sure students with disabilities receive full compliance under the Americans with Disabilities Act. However, given that the campus and buildings have all been constructed pre-1977, our school has not yet under gone the modern renovations necessary to fulfill all the needs of your daughter and her regrettable condition. Sadly, with recent deplorable f uh, federal cuts in education, it will, uh, it will take many more fundraisers to fully update Blackwell Academy, but that day will come! Chloe is without doubt an amazing student with a great potential despite her handicap and I believe she would be uh, she would find a more fitting rewarding scholastic environment at the H West M M Miskatonic Institute in Bolton. They have a rich legacy of disabled graduates and I know that Chloe would achieve her usual academic uh, leadership in more comfortable surroundings. With her outstanding GPA, there's no doubt that Miskatonic Miss would welcome Chloe with open halls. I hope you will seriously consider this suggestion as I'm sure your daughter would prefer to attend school that can cater to her needs. In the same spirit, I've also enclosed brochures for other other potential schools in the Oregon region. If you have any questions, please contact my office. Sincerely, Principal Suckadick. Oh, okay, now we know. Jesus Christ. Can we rewind time though? We can still rewind time. So that is I'm glad that I is interesting. Photo. Chloe has a new memory of William and her together. Mm. 
Makes me so That's sad. A serious heat lamp. Yeah. Yeah. Let's search all her things. Oh my god. I made that mix for her when we were 12. It was so cute, Pirate Power! So adorable! I'm sorry I'm going through all your shit, though. Ah, here's the DVD. Ah, we got the DVD. Okay, let's put the DVD in the DVD player. Yeah. And there you go. Hmm. This is just so heavy, though. It is. It's so weird. That the fact that she needs so much morphine and stuff like that, it's just Chloe. Makes me so sad. It's so sad. Stop making me sad. I want Chloe to be be able to walk again. We need to fix this shit. I know we can. I really do. Oh. 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 She's still awake. She didn't fall asleep or something. Or maybe she just woke up. <coughs> mm. I don't like seeing her like this. I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. <laughs> How dare you. I know you were beat down after the day with me. No. Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Uh, do you do you think Deckard is a replicant? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No. no. I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep. Oh, <laughs> that's true. You are a bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. Oh. <laughs> nice. Um. Yesterday was such a blast. It was great. Yeah. Seeing you. I it know is. things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates jumping mm. and running through the forests again. It meant a lot to me just to chill Hey, out no problem. No problem. We're always <sighs> here for you. Fuck. Um I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh can you pretty please go upstairs and get my my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's, Wait. Uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep this wag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? I'm on it, Chloe. Please don't tell me I'm gonna kill her with this. Like I don't want to kill her with this. So, maybe I should talk to her parents about this. Hey, William. Um, mm. Am I bothering you? Why, yes, Max. I love going through bills. <laughs> Kidding. How can you bother me? I haven't seen you in forever. Are you sure, I William? Know. You look exactly the same. <laughs> it's so cool. Good. Or I'd be scared if I didn't look like me. <laughs> <laughs> that is so you true. Seem more adult now. Yeah, that is also true. So what's on your mind? Hair room. I was impressed by Chloe's room and all the high tech equipment. You should be. We could buy a few mansions for what it all costs. Yeah. Insurance I understand. Helps, but I, I don't know, Max. Get it, I dude. know it must be hard on you guys financially. His bills are more like crushing. We have to mortgage our home, and that's Jesus. pretty scary. But, but we'll get through it. Price is always right. Mm. Get it? No? I don't know how to say this, but... I'm truly sorry about what happened to Chloe. Me too. All it takes is a few minutes to change a girl's whole life. But she's alive. She's been a trooper. That is true. Glad you're here, she's though. She's amazing. I'm so glad you're here to help her and be her father. I'm so glad Joyce is here to help us both. <laughs> Max, I, I just hate to think of what would happen to Chloe if I wasn't here. 
William, I just want you to know that whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. Always. I know you will, Max. Let's talk about Being Joyce quickly. You Joyce again is so nostalgic. Yeah, it is. Very old school, as they say. <laughs> oh, Very God. It's great for Chloe to see you. Makes Joyce happy, too. So, it's not all bad news in Arcadia Bay. Or is it? Hmm. Prescott family. The Prescott family might be bad news. Yeah. What do you think about them? Evil. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> More than I want to. But Joyce has to work for those greedy bastards at Pan Estates. Oh. I don't even like to think Interesting. about it. I didn't know that. I was reading about that missing girl, Rachel Amber. Oh, yes, yeah, she went to Blackwell, right? Oh, poor thing. That's mm -hmm. a real nightmare for a family. I get scared thinking about that is so interesting. that we might lose her someday. That is interesting. That is really interesting because no matter which universe, what do you think is going she on still gets kidnapped or weather, killed or something. Animals dying. Nobody knows, right? It is Nostradamus type shit, pardon my French. <laughs> but all I actually care about now is Chloe and Joyce. My family. I get it, dude. I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. It was so great talking with you again. <laughs> you act like it's the last time. And please, keep me from these bills whenever Aww. you want. Oh, Victoria. Uh, come by my room tonight. Max, are we cool? Just wanted to make sure since you walked away so fast. Nathan was worried, too. Uh, I, I, if you wanted to talk, hit me up, okay? Love you. Max, if you're mad, just tell me, okay? Silence, so if you want to talk, my door's open. Love you. Okay, let's actually go. Okay, we can see what they said in the past. Max, you're busy avoiding homework as usual. I told you I'd help you out. You, you never let me help. Okay, drama, stop. And you help me by caring. I do try. By the way, I scored uh, that killer bud from you know who, for your information. Save me a ball, gotta bounce. Max smokes weed? Now, I just wanna know all these things. Okay, what does, did dad say? Oh, you're, okay, that's... That's that's nothing new. What did Taylor say? Yeah, right. I cried like a bitch. Oh wait, wait. Uh, Max, thank you again for talking uh, for for uh, taking me to see uh, my mom. I think she wants you for her daughter instead of me. I think not. Your mom is a badass like you. Yeah, right. I cried like a bitch. So did I. You just didn't see me. It's okay to cry. It gets old. My stupid phone is about to die. Call me back. <laughs> okay, so that's Taylor. Nathan. Nathan is a ass but yo yo max you around in the dark room developing shots for the contest sweets so no two wills for you not yet i'll see you guys later though peace out why is he so chummy with them okay let's see if there's anything new happy birthday are you there yes give me some time to answer i can't text in every class uh some teachers get very pissed when people use their phones yeah because it's super rude blah blah hmm you said I could use your credit card when I need it. I only bought a film, not a camera. That is so interesting. She she is so different. Max is so different. And let's see Chloe. Hello, Max. This is William. If you want to contact uh, Chloe, you can use this number. She would love to hear from you. See you soon, I hope. Bye. Hey, Chloe. Maxine here. I know it's been a while. I just wanted to let you know I'm going to Blackwell Academy now. I hope this is still your number. Max is back. Blackwell? That is so awesome. You rule. Best of all, we can hang out again. So yes, this is my number. Cool. I've got a buttload of homework, but we'll get together soon. Don't tease me. It's been so long. I know. I'll see you soon. And Alyssa? Hey, Max. It's a shame that you hang out with those people. I thought you were different. Alyssa, I saw you throw that TP at me. Oh my god, I was not aiming at you, I swear. Don't do it again. That is so interesting. Do we have other pictures or something? Like, we know nobody anymore. This is so interesting. Yeah, should all just say to think that our destiny yeah. is linked to goddamn car keys. That is so... Yeah, I don't know what to say about this. Oh, I like it how he's 
trying not to swear. are just a preview of the tornado to come. And the Prescott Foundation? Yeah, what the Jesus. fuck happened there? Rachel Amber is even missing in this reality. Yeah. I guess I can't change everything. That is so... I don't know what to say. Food coupons? Really? Choices they need that? Food coupon, boss. That is so sad. No change to spare anymore. Mm. Now it's back to cookies. That is so sad. Me now. No, William, don't, don't, don't be shot in the in the now. Oh God. So her garage is now her room. That is so. I don't know what to say about this. Let's Joyce see. and William never had a garage sale before. You know, it, it's it's really bad when they need that. They're drowning in debt just to take care of their daughter. Such bullshit. So fucking bullshit indeed. I don't know what to say about this though. Let's go into their room first. Anyone home? Hey, Joyce. Oh, Max, it is so nice to have you around. Let's uh, look in the drawer. Can we when find a dildo? So hard. He's still awesome. That is such a sweet mm. shot, Chloe. I wonder. Probably if William. William probably. Look at that. Oh. They have no idea what's in their future. <laughs> That is so sad. Oh, They were happy back then. Oh no. I didn't realize oh, God. how bad Let's see. Chloe's entry really was. Uh, dear Mr. Miss Price, as we discussed last week, Chloe's respiratory system is showing signs of rapid weakening. This accounts for her recent amnia and loss of breath. As a doctor, I am committed to her well-being, but I want you to understand the reality that respiratory failure is common in people with severe spinal injuries. Your daughter is one of the bravest, strongest patients I've ever had, and I'm proud to be working with her. I just want you as parents to prepare for any and all possibilities. I believe Chloe should also be made aware of her changing condition. If you would like to discuss this further, you have my contact information. Makes me so sad. Yeah, I get that they that they like I would smoke so much you don't even know. Joyce is already a super I would. I would smoke so much if 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 that would happen morning, to Max. someone near oh, and close you and to Chloe me. Are so much quieter now than when you were kids. I remember. It's nice waking up in your house again. Oh, William and I love it. Finally seeing you and Chloe together after all these years. After the accident. Can I talk about the morphine? I wish I was a better friend. I know Chloe doesn't get many visitors. Oh, Max. You're Chloe's best friend for a reason. No. You're here exactly when she needs you. I know. Uh, Chloe needs help. Who helps Chloe out when you guys are at work? We have a series of revolving nurses mm -hmm. caretakers. <laughs> Chloe still causes trouble, even if she can't move. Yeah, Next, but that's Chloe. Chloe's condition is not improving. <clears throat> Her respiratory system is very weak, and she... Uh, she... Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <sighs> Choice. I'm so sorry you have to go through all this. Bad or good. I embrace every moment with my daughter and my husband. That is so this weird. This is what it means to be a family. And we'll always be one. No matter what. How are you doing, yeah. Joyce? I'm doing the best I can, Max. I won't lie. It's difficult. Yeah, I can understand. Holy fuck. life was easy here in Arcadia Bay. Um, uh, David Madsen. Do you know somebody named David <clears throat> Madsen? He, um, might hang out at the two wheels. Well, that was random. <laughs> yeah, he's a, a bus driver. He comes in sometimes. Cute, quiet. Why? Oh, um, I, w I was just mm. curious. Why is he you a bus driver? Work. Nice to see that everything doesn't change. Yeah, that's true. Lots of work. Plus, you guys have to work, too. Ah, oh, Bill and I have no time for us. So crazy. We're working more than we're living. I even had to take a part-time gig at Pan Estates. Ugh. Do you know yeah. the Prescotts? 
I know that Sean Prescott won't be happy until he owns everything in Arcadia Bay. Well, let's shoot him in the Stay face then. His son, Nathan. I don't trust Nathan. So, what do you think is going on here with all of this eco havoc? Maybe Arcadia Bay just wants to be left alone. I know the Aww. feeling. Honestly, I don't give a shit about too much outside our house. I understand, I don't dude. Any choice. I really do, Except yeah. Now we have dead birds and beach whales outside our front door. <laughs> so yeah. maybe I should care, for Chloe's sake. William. I have to tell you how much I love seeing you and William together again. He's been such a hero through all this. Chloe and I, lucky to have him. You're all so nice. Uh, is William still the same? Is William still the same? After... Everything that's happened. For better and for worse. But always for the I, I never thought I'd love a man so much I can't imagine life without him. That sounds corny, I know. Aww. Oh, Joyce. Shit. Yeah, she's Things so fucking awesome. I, I like how you think, kid. I better get back to Chloe now. It's good talking with you, Joyce. You too, honey. It's so weird. It's good for Chloe to stay in touch with her friends. It really is, I know. Oh man. Like, I don't know what's worse. For her, I, I don't know, it's... It's so weird. It's all about you, Arcadia Bay. Isn't it? I don't know, like... What if we save her? So what, you know? Uh, like, I mean, with the dad. Like... Is it really, really necessary? It's cool I don't know. Uses natural medicine too. Yeah, but natural medicine is not really what you need, though. You need good, real Nothing medicine. Either. Where's the shit that she needs? The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. Yeah, fuck ton more medicine. Is it in here? Here it is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. At least not in a way like How's that. How's it going, Time Tripper? It's funny. I think I look older. Can we take a selfie? So we can always hop back in time or something. I want to take a picture with Chloe. Because I know when we go from place to place, we keep that shit. Right? So maybe we can keep the picture and show Chloe what happens. If William lives. Something I don't know. A blue butterfly? I'm sure this no. is a total coincidence. It's a butterfly effect. We all set this all in At motion. We never had to hide from step douche. That is true. I uh? guess we stopped growing up together. A letter. Let's I see. I never heard much about William's brother. Hey Bill, sorry for not staying in touch since the accident. Work has been piling up and I and I am uh, being sent to Salt Lake City to oversee a new parking lot. You have to go where the work is these days. I wish I could have sent you a bigger check, but you know the story. Money is nobody's favorite thing. Maybe I'll see you next spring for a visit. Kiss Chloe and Joyce for me. Hang in there, Billy. Your brother, Aaron. Mm. Shoes. Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. Mm, her toys, let's see. Toys? I kinda wanna open <laughs> this and see what's in here. Maybe a lot of dildos. Probably. We bought crutches for Chloe. Hoping she might walk again. That is so... It's so heartbreaking. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Okay, dear Joyce, thank you for keeping me updated on Chloe's condition. I can only imagine the struggle you and William are going through. I'm so sorry that I can't help you with a loan at this time. Like everybody else, I'm underwater with my own medical bills. Please give Chloe a hug and my best wishes. Love, Aunt Dorothy. Yeah, if only the Prescotts would uh, be nice and give us all money and help us out. But no, the Prescotts are the Prescunts. I'm still overwhelmed Assholes. by this new reality. Can't we go back? Can't we just look at pictures and stare at them until until we fly back or something? 
It worked last time, so let's just grab all the pair of uh, Polaroids and just, just stare at them. Intensely. Maybe I, I want to talk to Joyce again about the morphine. If I can. Because I feel like I'm not sure if it's a good idea to just Things give it. Neat and tidy as William and I can't believe yeah, okay. How much you've Bye, Joyce. Done. You can keep on talking, but I'm walking away. I'm gonna talk to William. Maybe William is like, hey, you shouldn't give her morphine because it kills her or something. Because, you know, I'd rather not be, you know, <laughs> the one to kill her. If it's someone's gonna kill her, let it be her dad or something, but not me. Oh, God. I definitely have to take a third job. Jesus Christ. I know how the feels, dude. They might get their own home taken away because of medical bills. Jesus Christ. That's terrible. That is... A, a terrible is an understatement, my friend. It really is. Let's go. Oh, Eiffel Tower. Oh, it is the Eiffel sure. Tower. <laughs> That's great. They oh. finally went to Paris. At least they went. Now I have something to yeah. talk about. This is just for Chloe's basic supplies. Maybe I can talk to William now again about that. Hello again, yeah, see? William. Nice to see you back. Hi. Paris trip. So you finally made it to Paris. We, oui, as they say. <laughs> Not me, because I can't speak French. But it was a great experience. <laughs> that is so especially cool. Especially for Chloe. I can see her loving it there. You guys rock for going on a family adventure like that. She talked about going to school there. But... That's not practical anymore. That is so That's sad. Not fair, Max. I know what I it's like. I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. <laughs> you act like it's the last. Don't worry. It might be the last time, but you won't know. Just. We should really look at Polaroids. Can we go into the bathroom? No. Chloe's message board since the act. Let's see. Aww. It's nice my parents sent a card at least. Oh, Chloe, you know we love you and you're in our hearts and thoughts. We hope to see you smiling face soon. I wonder who this is. Kind of a generic Megan, card. thinking of you. Dear Chloe, I am so sorry for what happened. Know that I'm here for you. If you need anything, I hope you feel better and I hope to see you again. Kisses, Megan. Who is Megan again? I don't know who Megan is. I wasn't very available to Chloe. Okay, let's see. Real nice. Chloe, just uh, thought I'd drop you a quick note to let you know I'm thinking about you. I feel so lame writing shit like, oh, hope you are well, etc. I know your life is so different now, and I don't want that to get in way of her friendship. Yes, I haven't been around lately, but that will change soon. I hope you are well. Love, Max. At least I sent road trip selfies Aww. to Chloe. <laughs> I'm sure that made her feel great. Maybe I can look at that Polaroid and just, I don't know, fix that shit. Okay, Chloe. Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. Blue pill! I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And painless. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Okay. Did we do it? Are you dead now? Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Aww. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. That is so cute! <laughs> You're so adorable. Yeah, she is. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. Oh. Uh, can you grab one of the photo yes, albums over there? Yes. Yes. I'd like to check out some yes. pictures of us when yes. we were kids. Yes. Now we can go Please. back. My diary is like emo ground zero. No. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Yeah. Ever. Which drawer is it, though? Oh my god. Oh, shut up. I made that mix for her when we were Yeah, mixtape. Mixtape my ass. Okay, let's see. Despite everything. Aww. They're still a happy family again. It's cool that in this reality, Chloe really loves skating. <laughs> yeah, that is really cool, though. She still loves skating. Photo album. Oh, so that's the photo album. There's so many drawers I can open. But I need to... Yeah, I want to see everything. Oh, yeah, I already saw that. Chloe Shush. was a Shush! A we know, we know she was a great C student. Amazing. Beautiful. Great. GG, well played. Okay, now let's talk to Chloe. Let's see. 
Let's look at the album. Maybe we can go back Is that okay? again. Perfect. Oh my god. Look how little we are there. We look like toys. Mm. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. <laughs> and you laughed That's at so me. cute. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Oh. Turn page. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass and super a gangster. Here. I want to see it. Taken over Arcadia Bay when we had. <laughs> There's still time for you. Don't say that, dude. Can I open the window? Because I I feel like something's gonna go down with the window. I don't know why, but I have such a feeling. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. Hey, there's the picture again. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. Yeah, because it was for you. I wish it was. Me too. This photo... Maybe I could... Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing and... Uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was on No. So, I know I'm just putting off the inevitable. Don't say that, please. While my suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. I. This is not how I, I want things to have to be. You know. I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. No, I'm, I'm not gonna to kill feel you. Like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible, and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. No. Do you understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. No. No. Oh no. Chloe, I, I really don't know if I can do this. I had another friend yeah. who wanted to end it all, and I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible yeah. for ending yours? I mean, th there's got to be another yeah. way. Max, you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help me the same way. No, dude, come on. I want to help you, Chloe, but I I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you this can is just so sad. Look at me. I'm at the mercy of everybody. Let's for once. I want to make my own choice. The most important one of my life. Please. Help me, Max. This is... <laughs> Chloe. I'll just drift asleep. Dreaming of us here together. Forever. God damn it, no. I'm sorry, but like I don't want her to be I don't know. Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you think. I'm gonna fix this, dude.
I'm sorry, William. It's so sad. I need to kill her dad. So fucking sad. Someday dad will get one of them new <clears throat> computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. It is so sad. Hello? Hey, honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Shit, where are my keys? No, don't burn it! Don't be a f- Don't do that! I want to be able to fix things in the future, so don't do stupid shit! You can't hide from me forever. Don't you fucking burn it. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world-famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. Max, you are being so fucking strange. God damn it, Max. You're such an idiot! Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I... I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but... Come on. You have made things different. Like, my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you it's and a great so family. It's so fucking What's shit, to be sorry dude. For? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen. Whatever happens... I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. Mm. I'll always have your back. Always. And now we can't go back because Max is a dumbass! It is so sad. William dies. Everything goes back to what it was. And... I don't know what to say. It's... Not cool, dude. Well, the car crash never happened, then. We need to fix this shit. But let's see. Like, it's so... I don't know. I don't know what to say. Oh, this doesn't look too well either. Uh, shit. What the hell is this? Oh, you shouldn't have burned the freaking photo, you idiot! Chloe, you're alive, yes! Oh yeah, now you suddenly want to kiss me? <laughs> I'm just... I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Aww. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Oh. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. Why don't we just tell her? I feel like it's good to just be honest. Let's okay, look see? at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see. All the evidence. 
Well, I, I'm pretty sure it's Nathan who's he's so fucking close. up so so so, so many away. things. We have to do three main things, right? Um, uh, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. Well, that's easy. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat step douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the dark room. Hmm. Too bad I don't have a gun anymore. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, that's the solution. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. <laughs> Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. <sighs> don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. Yeah. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. Okay. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Will do. Who. And be careful of step crack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. Okay, I'm 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 I'm, I'm gonna try to be you know. I can't abuse this level of my rewind power. Yeah. It's way too dangerous, and I need to navigate the present without messing up the past. Yeah, I get it. That that, that is so yeah. true. This is a serious expose on the Prescotts. Finally. Okay. The, uh, okay. The name Prescott may not mean much to you, or the to to to. Uh, to uh, the name Prescott may not mean much to you, or to those outside the edges of a small coastal Oregon town. But this is a name that means quite a lot, uh, quite quite a bit in Arcadia Bay, a quaint town seemingly stuck in time. Once home to a prosperous fishing and tourism industry, the town has seen much better paydays, despite the local success of the prestigious Blackwall Academy and its football and swimming teams, the Bigfoots and the Otters, environmental changes to the area have reduced the amount of fish and other sea life, resulting in a stagnant economy and limited tourism. Oddly, the Prescotts have managed to keep their business interests quite profitable. In fact, they're behind an inexpensive, exclusive housing development known as Pan Estates, to be built into a deep forest near Blackwell Academy, local Native American groups have already filed various mo uh, motions against the development, citing widespread destruction of tribal lands and natural resources. That is pretty interesting. No, we're not gonna sit. Let's see. That's my Chloe. Yeah, that's so cute. It's so adorable. So adorable, all those things. So, let's look out for Step, step Douche. Hey, it's the still here. always makes me think of William and Chloe. Oh, maybe it's William in spirit form. That would be so adorable. This butterfly photo seems like a million years ago. How much time yeah. have they altered since? Fuck ton. Okay, let's try to avoid uh, Mr. Mr. Madsen. At least we can always, you know, Since rewind. Since David might be in there, I better mosey along for a change. Yeah. I I don't want David to be, uh, mad. If he's mad at me, then... Oh, fuck. He looks so sad. You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David! I didn't try to hurt you, ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Mm. Don't you wander off into the dark. He's so sad. It, I didn't want to make you sad, but you're an asshole. And you needed to learn your shit, dude. You fucking tits. Looks like David already booked a room. I feel bad for him. David isn't any different from me when he's looking at those family photos. He isn't. Okay, let's see. Uh, thanks for sharing. Uh, thank. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, let's see. Um. Uh, okay, what's going on? What is going on? 
Uh, okay, okay, it's officially sold out. I managed to get us both tickets. Had to fight a dozen bullies for them, though. Freaking nerds. Thank you for helping with my experiment, Dr. Maxine. Uh, I didn't help at all. You did enough so that I could get an A- minus instead of a B+. Plus. I was stressed about. Okay, I'll take credit uh, for your success. Congrats, I rule. Even though A- minus is such a bullshit grade. A minus? Somehow I think you'll survive. Tell that to my folks. Gotta jam, bathroom. Thanks for sharing. Yo, yo, Max, your friend Chloe texted me that you shot her down. True? Chloe actually texted you? I'm sure, uh, I, I sure didn't have her number. Oh, God. I, d I don't want to embarrass you. Too late. She's, she sounds cool. She's a cool dork. Like me? No, you're different in a good way. So we're still on and go ape? No damn dirty human can stop me. Go ape, not human. We shall see. I hope so. Now we have to get back to reality. That sucks. Indeed. Bye, you later. Hey, Dad said something. Um, holy shit. Holy shit. Okay, that's the high and stuff like that. Oh. Uh, I'm so sorry some jackass in my class thought it would be funny to send. Uh. Okay. That is so... Oh. At least we got our normal shit back. Uh, one plant was stressful enough. Now we'll get back to the books. Uh, talk to you soon. Oh, she killed her plant. Yeah, that's true. Oh, I can't wait to see you. Justin? Who's Justin? Uh, I don't know who Justin- Oh, that's the- the guy that has the same, uh, uh same voice actor. It's, uh, Warren. Sorry, my phone was in my bag. Hey, Justin, you busy? Max, Wax, I- I'm busy blazing. What up? Do you know Frank Bowers? Drugs. That's it? Ask Nathan. He knows him, I think. Okay, I'm on it. Thanks, Justin, for what? He's like, I don't know. I'm so blazing out. Oh. Uh, besides everything, I was just curious if you ever heard of a guy named Frank who lives in RV. You mean the da uh, the van down the river? I heard he's a sketchy meth head. That's about it. Why? Are you going to your own investigation without my help? No, I'm just bored. Talk soon. Oh. Ace Reporter. And Chloe. Sweet, I'll be ready. Uh, that and that was now that was no emoji. Oh, that's so adorable. She doesn't like emojis. Okay. Those poor whales are like beached angels. What is going on here? Ah, uh, it's just me fucking up my shit. Ouch. Uh, David, do not be here when I get back from work. I mean it. Mm. That that must hurt. Looks like they're back on the road to Paris. Yeah. Only with William they actually went to Paris. Why did I burn that shit? I hate Max so much. To think this all started with my vision of a tornado. Yeah, we kind of fucked it. That's a big TV though. At least it's not a small one again, but... Joyce must be so upset. Are you helping anybody, Max? I'm fucking up so much. I'm sorry, dude! It's not... It's not like I want to. Like, I literally do want to help people. It looks like David finished his car repairs. <clears throat> Maybe there's some new clues around. Yeah. We could actually try to find that out. Let's do this, Max. Okay. Let's see. It's an oil spill. Dun, dun, dun. Any new clues? Blue's clues or anything? No, no blue's clues? Locker! Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Yeah. Hey, David, what you hiding? We should know the code. Fuck, we saw it before. We saw the same padlock code before. Shit. Shit, For shit, once, shit, shit. I don't have time to search for the code. Oh, I need to find a way to break this padlock. What's the code again? I need to remember, remember, remember. I know that the, that I know the code. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. Probably armed. And I do not oh, like that. Jeez, David is back. There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this letter to Joyce. So sad. No, I'm not gonna break shit, dude. Fuck. Should I have signed the petition? Blackwell sure isn't safe and private anymore. 
I, I did I did sign a petition, a petition so oh, I'm just no, saying. Miss Grant, twist that. At least he has one wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? This is so weird. David must be working for the Prescotts too. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is pretty much confirming it. What's the padlock code again? Ah, shit, it was an easy code, I remember. It was like 4242? 1616? Uh, let's wait, let's... 4242. Oh, no, not 52. No. Uh, 7171 was one, I think, and... A oh, that was him! Yes! Yes! I knew that number would be important. Thank you! It was- I, I, my next guess would be 2626, I thought I saw somewhere too. I thought I saw those numbers somewhere too, so you oh, know. Maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Holy shit. Oh, yes. She knows something. Whoa! That is a lot of- Whoa. He even took a picture. Of Warren being beat, but by Nathan, but he didn't do anything about that. That is so interesting. That is so interesting. Score. Back to Chloe now. Oh man, I'm so happy that I, I like I I was just guessing the code. I knew it was two number codes. My God, just imagine if I had to use that goddamn crowbar. Things would go so bad so fast. So I'm really happy that I didn't, you know. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible yeah. to see William again. I wish Chloe could too. I knew it was a code. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. I wonder I'm if just, David is going to the party. I'm just happy that I paid. Well, I didn't pay attention. It's just one of those numbers that stuck in my head. There are just a couple of numbers that it's stuck, uh, were stuck in my head. It's amazing how much drama this living room has seen. Oh, Chloe. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. Mm -hmm. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and <laughs> plus oh, some location yeah. coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. But I absolutely have to go see Kate in the hospital right now. Yeah. I want to find out how she's doing. Yeah, that is important. You can't just leave her hanging. Like, that's just sad. We need to know. So it's interesting. 